Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today guys we're going to take a look at a beautiful 1968 Dodge Dart. This is a true uh, GTS car, uh, very rare cars, I think there's like 8200 of these cars produced. Factory 33 big block car. Um, car was restored i believe it was in 2017 and uh it was a complete body up restoration it's got less than 400 miles on the car since it was done uh, i actually took the car in on trade on a 67 gtx i had uh from a good guy out of west virginia but the car was actually restored at a, at a, uh, a company in iowa uh we do have the contact information for them we also got a listing of everything that was actually done to the car uh, really neat car again factory GTS car it is a factory racing green car with black vinyl interior uh, that is the original color um, like I say less than 400 miles since the car has been done uh, it's got a um, it, it does not have the matching numbers engine in it it is a 68 day coated engine but it is not the matching numbers engine um, it was also an automatic car that they have converted to a four speed nice car really slick paint um, chrome and stainless is really nice on the car it's got a good solid straight body it's um, a, it's got primer primer floorboards not a whole lot to really nitpick uh, paint wise and body wise on the car cars very very nice there's a crack right there you can see in the paint that was really the the worst that I see, sorry guys, just a little dust up there. Glass is nice. I drove the first day I got it. I put a few miles on it. I jumped in and drove it to lunch. Good car, plenty of horsepower. It's got a 300. It's dyno, the engine's dynoed at 360 horsepower. Uh, we do have the dyno seat for the car. Good car. It's got the white tail stripe. I love the 68 marker lights on these cars. Rear tail, tail bezels have definitely been replaced. It looks like the original tail panel. You can kind of pick it in a little bit, little ding there. A really nice car. I believe the car's got the original quarters on it. The car's nice and straight down the sides. Uh, brand new BF Goodrich radial TAs all the way around it. I am not hip with the wheels, guys. That was my one complaint about the car. Um, it would have came standard with uh, uh, body color steel wheels. Um, and I thought about ordering them and putting them on there. The problem is the, um, uh, the hubcaps that it needs are on back order. Those are, uh, see US mags, they look like Anson slotted wheels, but it's got a US mag cap on it. Pretty car. Does have front disc brakes. Again, factory green car. Um, Again, date code correct motor, but it is not the matching numbers engine. Edelbrock four barrel, you can see stock intake and exhaust manifolds. Got all the information on the engine. It's got a huge uh, Hughes cam, uh, Isky uh, rockers, it's got Eagle rods. I'll make sure I get that all in the listing. It's got a uh, Glen Hall Mopar uh, radiator with a shroud. Um, it's got all the K members all powder coated. It was uh, it's got all brand new polyurethane bushings, manual disc brakes, manual uh, steering, which is pretty much kind of, that's the way these cars would have came with a four speed. They've upgraded it to electronic ignition. Good running car. Paint's nice. Like I say, it's really got it's got got a good look to it. 
really nicely done car and again less than 400 miles on it since it was done can definitely nick, nitpick that A-pillar chrome, uh, they, that's original. They've replaced the mirrors, replaced the door handles. Definitely all your stainless is nice on there. New door, or, uh, new door rubbers. I've ordered new mats for it. They have not come in yet. Bucket seats, console, again, it was a factory automatic car. They've converted it to a four-speed. Uh, it's got all brand new gauges in there. I think uh, they're factory gauges, but they were redone by the company called Redline. Man, my battery's dying on my doggone camera. Uh, Flowmaster dual exhaust, eight and three-quarter, three-five-five sure grip. They've also um, upgraded the rear springs on it. Just a little dust there if you see that guys again I think the car has the original quarter still on it looks like the trunk pans original it's all body color like it should be we're gonna have to hurry Jordy my dog on cameras dying go ahead and jump in there Jordy will go give me one second you can fire it up it's clean underneath you can see I mean it's really nicely done uh, the rear end was powder coated. It's got all the markings underneath it. It's got uh, stainless steel uh, fuel lines and bushings. Go ahead and fire it up, Jordan. Yeah, it's a good turn. Lower motor works. I don't know about the radio. No. No, no on the radio. Even the reverse light on the dash works. Does got a good sound to it. Go ahead and go through these right away. Phone, uh, 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 headlights, yeah. Are the uh, are the those working? There you go. Sorry guys, my battery's dying. Gauges are all functional. It's showing 8200, but it's actually uh, you see a little reverse light works. It's actually less than 400 miles on the, on the car since it was restored. Up lights work. Go ahead, Jordan. Again, make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram or our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking a little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video. 